Stardust coming up there, not on this side yet, so can still swoop in from the right hand side. Stardust now. And is it above 80%? It seems like it, so it should have the explosion once... Yeah, there it goes, and most of the glaives have been cleaned up by that explosion. It's a 1 versus 1 between a Ponzi scheme in the red, playing as Cloakbots, versus in the blue it is Logix, playing as Cloakbots as well. Seemingly a very uneven match, and indeed it is, because Ponzi scheme is just so strong. They will easily beat Logix. Yes, of course. Eighty-eight percent wind, so wind generators right now two point three. Better start compared to Solus, for sure. So faster start by Logix, and also a more economically focused start here. Since well, conjured already out. But as on this side, we have five glaives coming up. E is on low, low prio for the const or like for the factory, but not five. Unlimited cloakbots, unlimited glaives coming out should allow them to get very good map control. And well, we can see that they've already taken down one little glaive. Are now healing up. Are also retreating, so decent fight, but not great. And just have better numbers. Though they do need to group them up. Whereas, yeah, the way they're controlling the units, they are still split up. Like, when they retreat, they shouldn't retreat, three, bleh, retreat these three. And now they are kind of clumped up. It's fine. Moving here against Commander is not going to work out. Four Glaives versus one. It does take them down. Of course, Reclaim is for the enemy. And pick off on the weak one there. Only three glaives for Logix. So with like six or seven they have over here. Ponzi Scheme should be able to move in here, kill these three, kill the Conjurer and the Maxis. Are now once again creating a couple of glaives themselves and indeed economy is going down. Still though, 20 versus 12. That's a lot more. I mean, they already have these, which is four metal. These are now coming up. All right. And the middle max over here, also up for logics already. A little bit more overdrive as well. Since, well, wind is still good. 1.7 each. Though, logics, watch out because you are now accessing. And that's a lot worse. Numbers for Logix are also pretty good right now. Better even than Ponzi Scheme has in front. So they cannot really take this fight right now. With the reinforcements they might be able to, but with the commander there for Logix as well. It's not advisable. It really just isn't. And since it is, like, well, not easy to, like, move around on this map. There are quite small choke points, which are easy to defend. The, yeah, one imp would be glorious, indeed it would. Staying on just glaives for now isn't really doing a whole lot. And you are now moving out, but yeah, not having these maxes yet does definitely hurt. Imp is something that, well, would be great. I mean, has decent AoE, so is able to hit... A good number of these glyphs only cost 120, I believe? 25. 125. And over here, well, let's see how, what the battle widget tells us. Uh, 400 to 600, right. So a decent fight for Logix. Right? Uh, yes, because I... Th no, I think this is... It doesn't say, but I think it's 850 lost for Logix. 650 lost for team 2, so Ponzi scheme. I believe so. Anyways, with the reclaim for Logix, it is definitely a lot better for them. Right. Reaver coming out, like, moving forwards. Okay. But against this number of 
glaives. It's not amazing and logic indeed engaging there. Only losing three of them. And even more reclaim for logics. Another 150 there, 360 here. Going to create caretaker just so that they don't really have to focus on it themselves probably. And so that their commander can just focus on better things. Still though, watch out because your energy isn't uh, that good. While wind is 80%. So, knight. Weird choice, I'd say. Like, why go knight when your opponent is pretty much full on glaive for now? Of course it does soak damage really well. And it's a decent way to counter imps, just because it is like uh, an instantly hit weapon. So that's quite nice. Over here, logics will not be expanding. And by now, I mean, logics has been pushed back a little bit, so reclaim in the middle, still 280, like 300 total, should now be for Ponzi scheme. Engaging with just four glaives against that commander, not great, but with the others coming in, it's a decent fight, and you do indeed take down that commander. 150% attrition, very nice indeed. About 500, better for you. Wait, so that means that 1400... Uh, I don't yet know how to read that widget very well. Oh well. Knight over here does go down. So 1300 reclaim, that's a lot. Currently being reclaimed with two conjurers by logics. Who still doesn't have a lot of energy. However, their enemy doesn't either. So both are accessing 700 for Ponzi Scheme, only like 170 for Logics for now. Almost a thousand for Ponzi Scheme now. And triple storage. Do we have a noob on our hands? Yes, we do. Uh, but it's understandable because of the reclaim. So you can build up a little bit of a buffer before overflowing. And that's of course why they only had 170 over uh, access. Though with only 17 energy right now, that's still going to climb very quickly. Even with 1500 storage. Commander over here is only a level 1, so could go down. However, if the caretaker like hurts the glaives a little bit too much, they will die. Explosion doesn't really do a whole lot, and Commander is indeed going down. There it goes. Does take all of the glaives with him. And 1800, how much exactly here? Like 1100. Should be reclaimed by Ponzi Scheme. But, well, since they now don't have a Commander, they should be getting up a little bit of storage themselves. Just because, well... All of that extra metal, that 10 metal per second, is all going into excess. And it's more than that because, of course, 0 0.8 on, like, two radars. Three radars? No, two. So that's 1.6 energy. They're not able to use for creating metal. Or, like, spending metal. Still, so, Breaver and Glaives moving forwards. Decent numbers. So are able to push logics back a little bit. Are you able to raid as well? Uh, difficult to say, but I do think that with your own glaives you did take a decent fight there. But of course, reclaim all four logics. Also, yeah, decent fight I'd say. Was pretty even. This is wasteful though. Don't know why you engage with those extra glaives there. Of course, this is also going to hurt because Reaver is not able to engage Ronin on its own. And Ronin does get another Reaver kill. Oh, another. At least it get, gets one. 
Fusion is up for logic, so they will finally not be energy stalling anymore. What are you doing over here though? Still on just 20 energy. No energy near your maxes, so no overdrive either. You're losing out on both a lot of energy and on a lot of metal. Going for a geothermal? Raised geothermal? Lower geothermal? Where are you placing that geothermal? The geothermal is going... Down? Seems like it. Very slowly, because, well... No energy. So still, not able to produce. Finally getting a little bit of energy, but... Do you know about overdrive? I wonder. Metal being taken down over there. So, actually not too bad. 45... 40 metal for them. Eichels? Mark, I don't know what you mean. Anyways. Please, moving forwards, we'll be able to clean that all up. But how do you deal with those Ronins? I mean, your Reaver isn't going to do it. Your Glaive numbers aren't amazing. And you taking Acid Map. Is this an Acid Map? Oh. You know... Oh. <laughs> Right. Uh, I didn't know this was an asset map. Right. Anyways, over here, well, glaives are indeed engaging those Ronins because, well, Logix is completely out of position with the drone. I assume they would be backing up the Ronins. They are not. So actually a very good fight there for Ponzi Scheme. 1200 taken down by Ponzi Scheme. I assume that's how the widget works. Right. Over here, once again, just a good old fight going on, but... <sighs> Reclaim should all be for Ponzi Scheme. And Logix doesn't have that many units left, as in none, pretty much. Uh, no. No. Do you want to move forwards right now? I mean, you do have numbers. Eh, difficult. You want to hold this position, I'd say. I don't think it's really worth it to move any further forwards. Like, sure, you're taking decent fights over here. But all of this reclaim should be for logics. Because you need to retreat at some point. You are doing that now. And your energy is finally pretty decent. Alright. Once again, pushing out more and more glaives. Stardust coming up there, not on this side yet, so can still swoop in from the right-hand side. Stardust now. And is it above 80%? It seems like it, so it should have the explosion once... Yeah, there it goes. And most of the glaives have been cleaned up by that explosion. So that was a very worthwhile little Stardust. Only 220 metal, and it did a very big boom. And now Glaives for Logics moving out. They have a good number of them as well. Four, six caretakers as well, so are able to push out units very quickly. Don't have the factory on auto queue. All right, interesting. And if you're being pushed back over here, that should be a lot of reclaim, and indeed they're trying that, for logics, which could snowball into a win. <sighs> of course, having your own reavers here is going to hold those glaives back quite well. But now there are a lot of gla glaives coming out. Still floating a lot of metal. Of course not accessing, so it's not too bad. And Logic isn't taking a very good fight over here against Reaver and Glaives, while having like pretty much similar numbers. Oh well, a lot of cat like uh, Conjurer is not doing anything either. Also, that hurts. They're like 
uh, defending the max. That doesn't work. Probably a misclick or the game being stupid. Not really sure. Glaive numbers over here, four points of scheme, a lot better. But with those very quick reinforcements for logics, uh, they should be able to hold on at least. Are now moving forwards to reclaim themselves and a... There it is. Fusion is now finally constructed, second one coming up as well. But being pushed back in the center. That hurts because where are your units now? Slings is not Sling is not going to do anything. And this Reaver is the first unit that's actually able to contest this. That's slow. Very slow. So it will take a long time before it can actually do some damage. Now you've been pushed away from all of that... Ac uh, from the reclaim. Eco going down. And with this many glaives, they can actually just engage against singular Reavers. Are also going to start raiding. Really nice. Should have done that an hour ago. How much reclaim? There is 4,500 reclaim in that field because the commander has still not been cleaned up. Surprisingly. I mean, that went down in like minute three or four. Still not reclaimed. And logic now is just way superior eco. Better numbers as well over here. So they should be able to hold on and push forward and just win GG. Right? I mean, Rev Reavers have been cleaned up. Glaives have pretty much all been cleaned up. They can just push forwards. They still have enough Glaives to push into the lo Lotus. But if you don't want to, just hold on. Get all of the reclaim and then you win anyways. But it's GG. Should have probably been won by Ponzi's game with how much better they were early on. Uh, because if you look at value killed, was a lot better for them. Pretty much the entire time. But yeah, I don't know if Ponzi Scheme knows Overdrive is a thing. Because they had no energy on any of their outer maxes. Really, really strange. Overdrive, yeah. 620 by the end of the game. That's nothing. Though I will say, Logic didn't have a lot either. Since they also didn't really get any uh, energy on them.